Why should you care about Atelier of Pointy Hats? Atelier of Witch Hats? Pointy Hats Atelier? All of them sound kind of bad in English. Why should you care about Little Witch Academia except it's actually good? The characters? Yes, but actually no. The story? Yes, but actually no. The plot? Yes, but actually no. The world? Yes, but actually no. It's the magic system. This is the hardest magic system I've ever seen in fiction. Yes, I saw Hunter x Hunter. This magic system in Atelier is a bit like science. Hunter x Hunter has nothing on it. Look at this page. It explains the basic rules and elements of the system from which the rest is built. This is like the axioms of magic here. Axioms. Ugh. Why should you be impressed by it? Why should you care? Because a system like that allows for a lot of creativity while still having specific rules that govern it. Remember Death Note? Death Note operates only on a set of explicit rules, but those rules don't create a system. They just state the abilities and limitations of Death Note, which is why there's so damn many of them. Magic in Atelier, on the other hand, is built on very few rules, but rules that are meant to create a system. If you understand how it works, then you can always follow along with the magic that's taking place in it, and most importantly, you can see it. Hunter x Hunter also has a system, but you can't really see the system, only its effects. Thanks to the magic being drunk in Atelier, you can see and read the magic, just like the characters in the story, and understand it, and predict it! It makes it feel realistic on a whole nother level, because you can predict it and understand just like reality. Honestly, this magic system is all I care about, and I'd even be fine if the story was just an excuse for exploring how it works. I don't know if the story and characters will be more reported later on, but I honestly don't care. I already love this manga just for this magic system. Look at this page. See how all the elements of this magic glyph work together? This page explains itself. Me saying anything would be just redundant. Or what about the levitation boots? They're just a standard magic glyph, but separated into two halves, one for each boot. Since glyphs activate only when the circle is closed, it means that the user can turn it on and off just by bringing their boots together. See? The rules of magic don't say that you can do that, it's just a logical consequence. Rules are one thing, how you use them is something completely different. It really is just like drawings and art. They also have specific rules called fundamentals, but none of those rules say what can and can't be drawn, only how drawing works. How you use it depends on what you can come up with. Indeed, Atelier is magical, just like art itself.